Hello everyone. Welcome to Medical Cyber Academy. Today we're going to review the anatomy of the respiratory system. In short, the respiratory system is functionally divided into conducting and respiratory zones. Conducting zone starts from the nose and extends to the terminal bronchioles. In this part, there is no exchange of respiratory gases and it is only responsible for warming, filtering, and humidifying the breathing air. Conducting zone includes nose, pharynx, larynx, trachea, bronchi, bronchioles, and terminal bronchioles. As it was said, none of the parts mentioned above have a role in the exchange of respiratory gases, and for this reason, the conducting zone is also called anatomical dead space. The respiratory zone consists of respiratory bronchioles, alveolar ducts, and alveoli and is responsible for the exchange of respiratory gases. Lungs, as the main and functional part of the respiratory system, include two left and right lungs. The right lung consists of three main lobes, while the left lung consists of two lobes instead of the middle lobe, the left lung contains an empty space filled by the heart. The right lung, due to the wider and vertical right main bronchus, is more exposed to foreign body aspiration. In these few minutes, we tried to explain the essentials of the anatomy of the respiratory system for a better understanding of the diseases related to the system, as well as a better understanding of the physiology of the respiratory system, which will be discussed later in the next video. If you liked the video, you can support us by liking the video and subscribing to the channel.